you do. Good evening, everybody. Yes, definitely evening. Hey, <laughs> didn't die. Uh, fourthly, it's uh, starting to stay daylight later. I think uh, it says like 5.30 now, so I have an hour here. There's a little window. An hour here before... Uh, for dark. Who dark Sally? So, take a quick little leap. That was exciting. Let's get started. And the Indian caught a train. Choo choo! Got them trains. So, I'll take a quick loop here. I was watching the live stream with Christopher David Lawson of NEPA. And in their discussion, I have no idea why, but somewhere in their discussion, we are talking about plans, different plans for people. And it kind of hit me. Vloggers, no matter what kind, whether it's meta vloggers, food vloggers, DIY vloggers, just vloggers in general, they tend to be in the rotation and even flow where they come and they go they're here for a few years hey they speed either hey say I'm not the only one out there I'm not the only one enjoying the 42 degree winter weather <laughs> they speed either alrighty Looks like Bodine 52. Bodine 52! I get sidetracked. It easily distracted. But they're doing a good thing somehow when you're on two wheels. But anyway, before I got sad, trapped by the Spider. <laughs> anyway, there's the even flow people were talking about their, their goals and things. One thing that was interesting, they all had one thing that they said. 
that is to meet up with people. Meet up with subscribers. And it's such a community type of thing. Whereas back, you know, I started I started watching at least probably about 2010, well, before that, probably 2007. Because uh, I started, I signed up for the YouTube in 2010. So it was before that. So I've been here for quite a while. I know in the earlier days, five to seven years ago, you had a few. You know, some of the originals, the all terrific, to do it with Dan. Chase on two wheels. I remember when he was only around a thousand subs. Uh, six foot four Honda. I'm trying to think of some more of some earlier ones, at least the better waters. There's, uh, there's other types of content I was watching too. That kinda had the same same humor for that stuff, but one thing that hit me while they were having the live stream discussion is the new round, the newer vloggers in the last year or two, maybe three years, the newer rounds seem to be much more personal. Seem to be much more reachable, touchable. Ah, okay, don't know about touchable. That's ah, a little weird. But anyway. Whereas the earlier years, back when I started watching and getting, uh, and getting my, my uh, YouTube fix, everybody was like an internet personality, and that's it. You mentioned Chase on Two Wheels had his photo vlogger meetup down in Georgia, but that was it. I kind of had a meetup, but you know, once a year, a big event. They of course, all, all the uh, all the cronies at that time. You know, they're all there. The Walter Ruffins do a dance. I don't know why. That's all I can think of at the moment. But you know, remember Cat Cam? I don't think it was Cat Cam CBR. Uh, but. They were just internet personalities. You had to go to a meetup to meet up with them. They did. They were just on the screen. They weren't near as personal. Whereas now, with the newer ones here in the last few years, yeah, of course you got to understand. Of course, security reasons, safety reasons, and obviously you're not gonna. They'll say, hey, here's my address, come on over. Or, you know, here's my schedule this week. I'm going to be here, there, and everywhere. Come, come meet me. Now, honestly, you don't want anything, because there's a lot of scary, freaky people out there. I'm a freak, but not that kind of freak. There's a lot of scary, sketchy people. So, you kind of noticed seeing that part of it, but even still, I had a chance to lose Mr. Mustache, Christopher David Lawson, when he had his meet off, had to meet PSB Tommy G, and a lot, of, a lot of the crew up there. And to me, it's just, it's different, which. Kind of why the even flow, I guess. And I don't know why I'm using that terminology, but that's in my head. This one thing that's kind of neat where, you know, channels come and go. People come and go. Life changes, you know, for, for various reasons. So, welcome to Millersburg, by the way. Found in 1807. Uh, People come, people go. Just like life in general. People die, people are born. And channels are no different. Channels come, channels go. 
and well the idea of just talking behind a camera and you know, the project people do bike builds and stuff but it's nothing new certainly nothing new been doing that for over 10 years but it seems like personalities change the desire change and to me it's really neat at least with the recent round it seems like there's there's a different sense of connection community there's there's a desire to have more than just that online connection there's that desire to be more than just an online personality than the internet celebrity or the one that's supposed to be like influencer but there seems to be a desire to be more and I love it. I'm happy for it. I like to see the change. And you know, it could be a to be part of one of the uh, some of the older ones fade away to life. Or they kind of change. But it seems like the new RAM where you get a lot more Less of just an internet personality, like a celebrity on TV, who, yeah, you may get tickets to a meetup, or, you know, you just may happen to get a book signing, or, or uh, stuff like that where you get to meet them. Really the way things were for the longest time. But now you tend to have more of that normal, everyday Joe. Or everyday Karen. <laughs> but you get more of that, hey, I'm just I'm just like you. Here I am. I'm nobody special. I'm just a poor old schmub. Out here doing the best I can, the best I know how. Yeah. Leaving you a little more into my life. Many times I want to get there. Just do that a few times. Get back there sometimes. Uh, anyway, concentrate, Bodine, concentrate. <laughs> anyway, but I really enjoy how the how the new the next wave of this. Oh, they're all such cliche words. I don't know what's a better word. I don't know what I like better. I guess a new wave of creators where. They don't seem as exclusive. They all seem as an internet personality. If they are someone who you can actually message or email or whatever the case and say, hey, I'm coming to your area on this time and this date. Can we hook up and maybe have a beer or coffee or dinner or whatever the case whereas back 10 years ago back with the, uh, the previous group yeah sure you could you could do that because well social media but you normally would get kind of a canned unresponse response of Oh well, like to. Oh, that'd be great, but you know, we're going with something. You just didn't have that that reachability. So, oh, I kind of like how the how the new way how the uh, how the more recent uh, vloggers. Their, uh, their kind of identity, I guess. Their, their uh, mentality of it all. It's just a little different. You know, very much more personable. 
It's been with all the live streams too. I don't know if maybe that has to do with it. Maybe it's the same way the live streams happen. That built a closer, uh, closer uh, knitting. I don't know. I'm not sure why. I often don't know the why. It's always drive my teachers crazy in school. Because I always wanted to know the why. Ah, oh, that's great. 2 plus 2 equals 4. Why? Who came up with that? Why did the person who decide that 2 plus 2 would equal 4? Why did he get that power? Who made him the math, math the mathematician king? What made him the one who decided the two plus two could equal four? I mean, why? Who? Why? I, I want to know. So, focus, buddy. Focus. I don't know why I should do that. Sorry. If you don't subscribe to Bodie Fifty Two, you have to. If I didn't give him enough plugs there something wrong. But, anyway, I'll put it somewhere. Go check out Booty 52. Help him focus. But I don't know if it's just because of live streams or it's how things evolve. The only thing that stays the same, the things are all the changing. That's one of the things that changes, evolve. has to do with the uh, the events of the last year. Kind of sheltered everybody in. <laughs> kind of had us forced to be nothing more than an internet personality. There's no meet up for you. Well, yeah. Bad. Bad. No meet up. Meet up, get virus, die. So, I don't know. Maybe that has something to do with it. I have more questions and answers than people. I know. It's not burning. How many things? Phew! I love for the smoke. It's not taste. Woo! Alright. That's a distinction to get. Wrong one. There we go. Where are we? There's a little chili in the valley. 38. Okay. Yeah, it's hey, it feels a little chillier. <laughs> about, uh, about 40 minutes till I get home, so it might be a puff symbol then. Uh, <laughs> and then the 38. Welcome to Elizabethville, the star of the valley. Yeah, what do you think? Do you like the changes? Do you like that the internet personalities are more reachable? Have you noticed that with the creators you follow? Or, uh, or is it just kind of... Kind of just luck, I guess, that I find creators just the same kind of, uh... I don't know, personality? I don't know. You notice that too? Or is it just me? Be honest. It's probably just me. It's always just me. I'm so dang it, I'll foggy. <laughs> but there's a little chili. Very long. Okay. There. Well, there you go. So that's my thoughts for the moment. That's my thoughts for the moment, and the moment's gone. All we are is dust in the wind. All we are is stuck at a red light. What else is new? Tink. So, everybody have a great, wonderful day. If you didn't fall asleep already. If you did. If you had a great, wonderful nap, 
and happy to provide you 15 to 20 minutes of <laughs> sleep if I had pleasant dreams. Cause you're a dreamer. Nothing more than a dreamer. Alrighty, bye bye everybody. Let me climb the mountain.